Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and the first episode for the Royal Mech Lance. Um, I'm just going to call the whole unit Vengeance. So um, if you haven't seen the very first episode of The Duelist, um, go check that one out. That is brings us up to date to where we are here. Um, I'm going to run this one congruently with The Duelist series, uh, which will have its own playlist. Um, so this one will be in a separate playlist and I'll just number this one uh, number this series so it's gonna look the numbers are gonna be very weird on it it'll be to match the duelist series so um, wherever we are with the duelist series actually that might not work now that I think about it because we might we might actually have end up having more missions here than with the duelist I don't know we'll see how it goes I'll probably just number them one at a time but um, when they appear will probably be alongside the duelist uh, probably the day after the duelist um, runs so um, yeah we're gonna pull off a first mission here with these guys today um, if you haven't seen the duelist uh, the very first video for the duelist go check that out that brings you up to speed I'm not gonna go over any of that stuff here the only thing that's different between the last episode and this one is um, in the barracks um, dragon had enough um, experience to get tactics up one point so I did that I made sure everybody had uniforms like I always do and lighting was identical for everybody so they all look uh, like professionals um, and then I did the color scheme and everything and the name and the stuff so if we go to the mech bay real quick you'll get an idea of what our color scheme is going to be it's sort of a, uh, a copper and yellow with a gray um, uh, I guess secondary color um, you know we're called vengeance so it's you know got to kind of be that way. This guy I couldn't get to look good no matter what I did, but what do you do, right? Uh, the thorn doesn't look too, too bad, and then the uh, locust looks pretty good. So that's our lance. Now, uh, let's go to the command center real quick because we're going to jump in straight to a battle. Now, we've got a couple of choices here. I haven't actually had a good chance to look at it, but I think we're going to take the escort in the desert. The reason why we're going to take the escort is there's usually lots of, well, not lots, but a couple of... Uh, couple groups of enemies most likely it'll be vehicles but this should get us lots of salvage and stuff to be able to um, help improve our mechs now the problem that we're going to have is the wavern is not the best we need heat sinking on it that's the big deal with that so we're going to go ahead and negotiate we're going to take this we're going to go full salvage so we're just going to go ahead and take that let's get vengeance out of there i should probably save him as the uh, a lance but uh Go ahead and drop these guys in. That one, that one, and this one. And then we're going to go uh, primary pilot. I think we're going to run with Dragon. And then we'll get Smirk on the Sentinel. Let's get... Whew, okay, well, Outcast is really the only pilot we have for the Cyrano. Uh, man, who do I want? Who do I want where? Max Evasive, I think we need, or Escapist, we need to put you in the Locust. That'll really, really help the Locust out. And then probably Wrangler in the Thorn, just simply because she's got more experience than anybody else. And we'll go this way. Let's go. Command interface initiated. All right, fingers crossed we don't get a pasting. So we need to help Comstar, our Comstar allies get their, uh, their stuff to the uh, evac point. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Looks like there's nobody here to start, which is great. Oh, I haven't played on this map in like forever. Oh my god. That's awesome. Okay, let's get right here. Um, we're going to put Wavern up here. Let's see if we can get in the trees. Um, Sentinel. Let's go with um, Thorn and Locust, and then we'll put the Cyrano inside the uh, extraction point. It's probably going to be a 5-on-5 five -five battle here, but we'll see how it goes. Hopefully we get some good allies. Fingers crossed. Oh, we got guys across the water. Shit, that's bad. That's bad. Okay. Um... So what do we got here on our side? Coolant truck with some vehicle flamers. Okay, ER smalls. A 
Badger with an LRM-10. That's not bad. And then what's the last guy? Is there another one or is it only three? I don't see any more. I'm here. Um, do I want to reserve? There's probably somebody up ahead here, though. Let's go see if we can scout hey. him out. Okay, they're across the river. So we've got a mongoose. Thorn. Stinger. Okay, 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 okay. Not so bad. Not so bad. Uh, you're done. How much evasion did we get? Four. That's it? Okay. Sure. Why not? Yes, Commander. All right, we got ER large here, so let's get in the trees. Just gotta shot that stinger. Probably gonna be like two percent or something. Okay, we got a chance in the mongoose as well. Oh, five and nine. Take a shot at the mongoose. So he's down two energy weapons, which is good news for us. I was just about to say something stupid like, ah, this might not be, end up being too bad for us. We haven't seen what the final lance is going to look like yet. Okay, so there was another vehicle. I guess it was hiding underneath the, uh, it was hiding underneath the, uh, one of our max streak two and a medium pulse. So that's the stinger. Receiving you. ER, laser, large laser, Blankenberg, variety of damage. Do I want to... No, I think we're pushing forward. I think we're going forward. Going forward. That guy's hidden well, really, really well behind that uh, dock over here. We got another guy. That's the thorn, right? Two thorns. Okay. The pot shot. On it. Just you're targeting a little right, kiddo. Reporting negative damage. Yeah. Yeah. I see. Yeah. Oh, the damage and the screams is priceless. Okay, LRM five? No. Receiving you. Yeah, this is why. I mean, we got lucky with this first battle. This is like, this is like Double a choice nine. battle Let's for go. us. We'll get some half decent salvage out of this, and then uh, not have to worry too much about dying. Doesn't necessarily mean we won't, but. This gas rifle connects. Whoever gets hit is going to be in a lot of trouble. Waiting for orders. Okay, how far can you go? Not that far. Not that far. Not that far. That's not bad. Let's get our frontal yeah, armor on those guys. Got the wolf logo on the side. That's kind of cool. Take a shot at the guy in front of us. Missing alpha strike. Oof. These guys are better shooters than we are at low percentages. Good to go. They're just showing us how it's done. That's what they're doing. Let's go here. Can't get that far, huh? Okay. Sprinting. It might just be the four. I would have thought there would have been one more though. All right, not the best chance to hit, but. We gotta take it because we want to try and clear this guy out in front of us. Waiting on you, Commander. If we can just not have to worry about the guys in front, that would be good. Okay, you won't let me do that. I hear ya. On it's my fine. way. Brace it. Now you. What can I do for ya? Should be able to bypass these guys, right? Yep. Got it. Max speed, no shooting. So you're in range for the lasers, that's good. And fire. Here we go. Ooh, two on. One looks like a groin shot. Beautiful. Receiving you. Alright, buddy. Uh let's see how bad you got it. Besides like not having any ability no to move at any running. kind of Stop. speed. We need a bigger core. Alright, shoot this guy. 
All right, three hits. Yeah, the early game's always so slow. Especially when you don't choose experienced pilots. Holy shit, that guy got a shot on the badger. Badgers? You got a shot in the badger? What now? What now? Field command. Use it. You've got it. Use it. I don't want to get too close to this guy. Oh boy, here we he go. He may get around behind us, so let's just get over here. Still four chevrons, eh? Really? How is it only four? She's got a plus two max, so I'm not exactly sure how we're only getting four out of that. Okay, some good damage. That's some pretty good damage. So both those thorns got large lasers. Might be nice to switch out the Gauss for some ER larges in the uh, Sentinel. And then use the extra weight for like, I don't know. I don't know what. Something. Armor, and then I don't know what else. Jesus Christ, these guys are good. Ordered. Okay, let's get up here. It's our Thorn's turn. 40-28. Yeah, I think it's going to be that one regardless. Stinger might... Well, 5428. I think we need to finish this guy off, though. we got to get him out of our way here. Firing all weapons. Yeah, damn it. Damn it. That did not hit. That Here did not hit. Not at all. Yeah, we can take a hit from the thorn. Let's get up here. Roger that. Full speed. What are we looking at for evasion? That's a lot. It's pretty good. All right. Hopefully the tag lands in this guy. Knowledge. Yep. And the large laser. Nice. Torso or arm shot? Torso. Okay. Somebody go after this guy going now. Okay. All right. Oh, I, I'm wounded, Commander. God damn it! Really? Got something you want done? I've always got something I want done. On my way. Question is, Mr. Cruz, are you able to do it? Forty-eight, twenty-one. Let's give it to him. Acknowledged. Yes. He was asking for it. Critical hit, Commander. Good to go. I might be like forced to take a whole bunch of, like, take a double heat sink kit now. A whole double bunch of double line. heat sinks for the uh, Wavering. I don't know. Waiting for orders. Yeah, just stay on target. Going turbo. Keep your armor to the front so they hit the side of you. What are we looking at here? 14% in this guy. And less on that guy, I guess, because maybe he moved further. Got it. Nothing. Nothing. Hey, stand still when I'm attacking you. What can I do for you? God damn it, really? Alright. See if we can follow up on this guy. Okay, one hit. Nothing from the streaks, though. That's fine. We can always send the Cyrano over there to do, the, do all the dirty work. 
think you need to keep on the uh, mongoose here. Just don't shoot our own guy, all right? Oh, everything's in range now, pretty much. Okay, a little bit of damage, not bad. Ooh, you know it's terrible when you're, you know it's terrible when you're getting excited about like a couple of LRM hits. I hear ya. Oh my God, we hit with three LRMs. Isn't that fucking? That's great. We're, we're murdering them. All right, uh -huh. let's get up to here. Interested to see what this would be. 19. Yeah, let's see if we can continue some damage on this guy. Okay, a couple points. Commander. All right, where are you going? Let's see if we can follow up on the attack on this guy. Look at the movement on this guy. Confirmed. Because then I can forget about the, uh, the stinger if I can take care of him with this guy. That's a pretty good chance. Let's take it. Locking on target. Good night, sweet prince. XL engine gone, That's but a kill. one less guy we got to worry about. What's up, boss? More worried about keeping our guys alive here. Okay, get to here. I get you on the move. Come on, land the Goss rifle. Roger. Land anything. Spit on him. Do something. Oh, come on. This game is rigged. Commander. Um. We gotta get rid of this mongoose. This is why I wanted him gone. He's starting to get to our. Moving to position. See these light mechs have a tendency to flank you, and I, that's why I don't want him here. I wanted him. I wanted him out of the way, so I didn't have to worry about this shit. God damn! All right. That's all right. Failed to connect. You did. It's okay. We go before the mongoose. We're gonna get the locust over here in the trees, facing inwards. So that guy can't get around behind him, and then we're gonna hit hammer his side. Hopefully, take that torso. I don't think it's this this mongoose. I don't think it's running XL, but we can blow his side off. I'll feel a lot better. Yes, commander. Like this. Moving to position. Still, terrible chance to hit. Copy that. Firing out straight. Like I'm at a freaking disco. Did you actually hit his head? I guess you did, yeah. Tit for tat. Nice. Or was that me? No, we hit him. Need to take the time to start reading stuff. Okay, who's up? Waiting on you, Commander. Are you? Don't wait for me, just get in there and get the fight done. Man, these guys are going to get to the L point, and some of these guys are still going to be alive. All weapons are go. All right, a couple streak hits, not bad. Better than the rest of us are doing. It's such a difference. Like, I keep trying to think about the BattleTech universe and how realistic slash unrealistic it is. It's so. From a military perspective, it's just so bizarre. It's great from a gaming Waiting perspective, don't get me wrong. But like from a military perspective, it's just so bizarre. Like a lot of things just don't make a lot of sense. But it's big stompy robots. And like big stompy robots don't make any sense. Waiting on you, Commander. you know what I mean? There's just no practical application for them. Affirmative. I mean like I understand, like as a recovery, as a recovery unit, or for clearing trees, like large forests on a planet or something like that. You. There's like potential for for use, but my God, this thing is so slow. On it. 
I didn't realize how slow 4-6 movement is until you actually have to, like, On it. try to keep up with light maps. Nice. Still going, but at least he's taking a dump. Good to go. Keep I on that thorn. Moving out. Stay on target. Stay on target. Time to die. Nothing. Get you next time. No, I highly, it's highly unlikely that you will. Right here. So that was the, this pilot. How many activations remaining? A couple. Let's see if we can get him to bail out here. Torso should be a head hit. Critical hit, Commander. Hey, okay, beautiful. Beautiful! That's a bit of salvage. I don't think he's running exile because we blew his torso off, so. Orders. I know it's not Clan XL because I saw he lost a heat sink. Single heat sink. Jesus Christ, I gotta go pretty far now. Can I not get a back shot? Oh, there we go. Double time, let's go. Might be interesting to try to do an all aircraft playthrough. Got the angle, taking the shot. At least the tag's on. It would be really tough, I think, because it's like. I find finding good VTOLs is difficult. The fact that they're so high up all the time, it's not like you can hide anywhere. Jesus Christ, this guy's murdering us. You got nothing, you hear me? Oh, he's got something. He's hitting with you, hitting you with it too. We're getting to the range where the Gauss rifle is going to be like taking negatives to hit. 35, 42. Come on, land it. Taking the shot. Not today. Reporting negative damage. Yep. I can see that. Full speed sounds good. Uh huh. So this is an interesting loadout for Royals. I've, I've dabbled a couple of times with like seeing what it would be like to, to have a Royal playthrough. One of them I, I started off with the Phoenix Hawk as my my primary, which is not bad. What can I do for you? I hear ya. You know, there's still there's a few like half decent Royal mechs, but it's also iffy, right? Like the double heat the double heat sink kits are great, but you can't take them out. This should be we learned that in the first episode of the Duelist. Hey, stay in the crosshairs. Couldn't even burn the ground, huh? Go. Couldn't even burn the ground. Clear the guy out in front of us first. That's pretty good. Let's wind this up. Not bad. Yeah, baby. What can I do for you? Okay, not bad. Hopefully, this guy just won't shoot us next turn. Ooh, that's pretty good. Got it. Take that. You know it's bad when the vehicles you're escorting do more damage than you do. Standing by. Well, this guy did pretty good last turn, so I shouldn't be uh, complaining. This is full speed. Christ, I should head across the water now, for Christ's sake. Throttle down. Oh, uh, we're overheating too, which is not really a good thing. Let's just fire the LRMs. Confirmed. Firing. Nice. Who's up? I hear ya. Vehicle. Don't Alright, you got a point. potential for doing some damage. Let's get him, baby. Let's get him. Okay, who's up? Ready for orders. You are. Aye, aye. I'm trying to slow us down here a bit. You don't get as much evasion, but I don't want to be like flying, having to fly across the map. Firing on target. Okay, tags on again. Oh, do we hit with the laser too? Nice. A little bit of a That's delay there. Why. Ooh, um.
You're bleeding? Um, okay. Didn't realize you were bleeding. That could be I'm real fired. bad. Let's just get up here. Coolant protected, eh? Nice. I'm sure, not sure what that means, but I guess because I'm on a coolant tank, maybe it's like... I take less heat or something? Standing by. Okay, that's not bad. I think it's still outside the Goss's minimum range. Just do a little peeking over the hill here. I got something for you. Ooh, see ya. Target neutralized. It's too bad I destroyed all the juicy stuff. Waiting on you, Commander. But as long as he's dead, that's all that matters. All right, two more turns and these guys are out. Oh man. Tell me what to shoot. Uh, I may need some more time in the simulator. Yeah, don't blame like don't ask me, man. I'm not uh not on my side. You do your simulator thing on your own time. Okay, going after him. We're gonna try a back strike. Yes, Commander. Uh, thorn against thorn? Affirmative. This be a thorn in his side? Affirmative. Nope. Whole lot of nothing in his side, apparently. Alright. Ready for orders. Dragon Ball Z, let's get up here. Let's move. Gonna move right into the water next turn. Got it. Yeah, definitely need a double heat sink kit on this guy. You can't even hit the pulse, man. Come on, really? Really? Waiting for orders. Uh-huh. Man, we still gotta get out of here too. Take this! It's gonna be a whole other lance. Hopefully it's not a tough lance. That would be a miss. It would be. What can I do for you? Oh, you're the flamer guy. How far can you go? Perfect. Moving fast. Good to go. Get as far as you can go. Got it. You should be able to all get out of here next turn, hopefully. Then all we have to do is get to our extraction Fire. point. I've got. Hopefully we don't get any real dedicated clan mechs. Uh, who's up? Right here. Bleeding out, three activations remaining. Um. Let's go with first aid. Okay, get in the front of this guy. That's right, baby. Look at me. Ooh, two for two. Mech destroyed. All right, I'm gonna move these guys into the out point here, and then I'll be right back. Got it. Max speed, no shooting. Alright, well that didn't take much. Looks like we got some more guys here. Looks like it might be another thorn. That looks like a um crap. Can't remember the name of it. I know what it is though. Miss Lynx. The package will be on its way. There should be some over here too, if I'm not mistaken. Waiting for orders. If I am not mistaken, they should be over there. Too far, huh? Who's left? Come 
Commander. Uh, we need to get up there. Roger that. I'm just gonna quickly speed these guys along. Yes, Commander. Oh, okay. Um. Full speed, no target. Let's see if we can see where the enemies are. So there's three, four. They're all over there too. It's only four, huh? So Miss Link, Solitaire, Thorn, and Locust 1C, which could be really bad news. Receiving you. All right, slowly getting there. Roger. I think all we gotta do is kill these guys. I mean, I we could go ya. for the exit point, but what's the point? Uh -huh. Okay, Good I'm to go. Got unjammed. All right, who do you want to hit? Locust probably because he's the lightest. Point nine. Point nine. Point nine. Point nine. Let's go with Locust. Target That's a lot anything. of friggin' lasers. That's what I mean about being a bad news. Alright, here we go. It's gonna give them two turns to get to where we are. Yes, Commander. Five activations remaining. Okay, so first aid helps a lot, so we're gonna get up here. Accelerating two locations. Oh man, I hope we don't have to bail out. Orders. Okay, get the thorn up here. I almost wish we had the LRM thorn now. The LRM 5 so I can at least shoot somebody. But the ER large laser is nice. Waiting for orders. Okay, we know the locust is up there. Let's see if we can get a back shot on him. I know I'm opening myself up for trouble here, but I've got lots of evasion. It's a side shot. That's fine. Taking the shot. Nothing, really. Alright. Failed to connect. That's right. That's right. Waiting for orders. Let's go, Smirk. Get up here. Get that big Goss rifle into play. I don't think we're ready for this uh, stand-up fight here. I hear ya. Got it. Okay, who's got the LRM? Not you. Resting Is it you? my neck. No. Sounds smart. Cooling. Excellent. Who's up? Thorn. Miss Lynx. What do you got? I have no idea. What can I do for you? Still think this is the best bet. Guy's nasty. Nothing. Oh well. Systems recycling for another shot. I mean, I guess I could. I guess I could have just like kept one out to keep them focused on the vehicles as opposed to us. I guess it doesn't matter though. Come on, buddy. Let's see what you got. Solitaire. Looks like he has a broke, at least one broken weapon. Ooh, large heavy laser. That's not good news at all. Ready for orders. Got it. Oh, you're so slow. This guy's probably the best target now. Firing. Now that I know he's got that large heavy laser. Good job. Objective secured. They're doing a pretty good job of keeping their back to us. Standing by. Four activations remaining. Let's get into here. You say so. 
Now let's see if we can do the uh, first aid again. I, don't know, I, I think we have to be sitting still for that. We do. Let's just activate field command for this turn. We'll brace here. Standing by. We're waiting for this guy to get up here. Crying out loud. He's got all the armor. He's hot at the back for crying out loud. Firing. Oh, this is going to be bad. Okay, a couple of hits. Yes, Commander. I keep saying that. I don't think I understand what that word means. On the move. I mean, the last battle was pretty tough with the uh, in the Duelist series getting wrecked by that specter, but it could have been way worse. I mean, we could have been facing a really deadly clan mech. Ultra 2, baby. Standing by. I like Ultra 2s. Let's see if we can claim it for Not our own. Way. All right, back shot. Locked on rear armor. Nice. Got past the armor. Who's up here, Locust? Okay, you only landed one shot. We're lucky there. We are lucky. Ready for orders. Roger. Okay, you're 40 tons, so you got a bit of armor. Not that worried about moving up. See how it goes here. Take a shot at this guy. Don't hit our copter. Locked on. Damn it. You got lots of ammo too, so I'm not worried about that. I just hope our Wavern gets into this battle soon. Beyond, like, LRM strikes. I like the balance they made with the, uh, the bleeding out, where it gives you a couple of extra turns. Because now you're not just forced to sit there and, like, constantly apply first aid to yourself. You can apply a bit, yes, Commander. then move, and then apply a bit more, and then move. Which we're going to do here. Um, gonna first aid ourselves. Receiving you. Cause we're waiting for this guy to show up for crying out loud. Still taking forever. No, I'm not gonna bother. We're gonna add heat. Let's not. Let's not do it. Let's just not do it. Good to go. Um. Yeah. Get into here. Interested to see what our chance against that locust would be. So we got Miss Lynx at 19. Locust at 19. How much is this? this guy's got 336. Pretty much the same armor as the uh, locust. Let's see if we can get this guy because we can get two shots off on him. Locking on target. Nothing. Damn it. Well. Negative damage. Repeat. I can't Negative complain. Damage. You need to kill two thorns, so... Good to go. Good to go. Hmm. Every time I get close to that locust, I get nervous. Actually, that's not too bad. 33. Let's hit it up from back there and see if we can get land a shot in that Miss Lynx. He's probably going to move this turn anyway, and if he doesn't, we're going to pull back there and then hammer him. Target lock on enemy six. Okay, another tag on him. Commander. Bring the thorn in. I'm going to stay hidden for now. I don't want these guys shooting at me. So we'll get this guy. Jeez. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do with that hatchet, man. we got to get a bigger core, get some more speed out of it, because we're not going to be able to win duels 
with that at that speed because we're going to be trading off back attacks like as soon as we close they just go behind us and just destroy us right so the specter was a good example of that like imagine facing this lo <laughs> this locust you know he just keeps running behind us and just kills us all right i can't take much more you can and you will Oh, Millie. Lamb to the slaughter. Sorry, that was a charge attack. I take that back. Fucking bullshit. Anyway, whatever. I'd love to see somebody run around a corner and slam into somebody at full speed like that. I challenge anybody. To try to do it. I don't understand. I don't understand. Awaiting orders. All my weapons are gone. Back in action. Are you? Is that what you think? Uh, I don't have any ability to melee. Like. So apparently he can melee me, like charge me, and have no problems at all, but apparently I can't do it back. Um, why? Wilco. It's like you could say, well, you know, your arm's gone. You don't have the stability. Tell me how many arms right the locust has. Talking about fucking stability, Locust doesn't have any arms for crying out loud. They're little nubs, so it's not like they're keeping his balance up. Anyway, whatever. Let's just make this guy pay for what he did. Critical hit, Commander. Yeah, we're not done with you yet. Waiting for orders. We're not done with you yet. Oh, you had to miss with the large, did you? At least the tag's on. Commander. There we go. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Thank you for being a sacrifice today. Hostile removed. Standing by. Um, let's sprint. Aye, aye. Well, I guess they traded Max. It's fine. I got no weapons left. Good thing I did five points of damage there, though. Oh boy. I'm gonna get you. That was just a gimme. Yeah, you run. You run. Coming after you next. Well, that was interesting. I guess he's dropping his heat. Makes sense. LRM Thorn, okay. You keep shooting me, buddy. I'm good with that. I'm good with that. Standing by. Actually, let's move back here. I'll try. Because we are going to go ahead and do another first aid next turn. Get it to five, and then Receiving you. we'll worry about uh, worry about what's going on in the real world. Wait, that's the, yeah, that's right. Okay. Okay. Commander. You. So the locust is that's the front of the locust. So. 
Uh, is that going to give us what we want? That will. That will. Copy that. Although we're not going to get a lot of, of um, evasion, but we are got a bit of height, so it's helping us a little bit. So 46 on you, 52. I should. The locust is far more deadly, so let's just go after him. Firing at enemy six. Damn it. Keep the pressure on, though. That didn't hit? Nope, not today. Ready to get it on. Not today. Oh, wait. What? What? Oh, there you go. All right. Position confirmed. Bing. Engaging. Hey, we're rolling low on ammo. We're over halfway through our ammo. I can't get out there until the Wavering can get ahead of everybody else. So that Locust is going to strip a lot of armor. I'd rather have him shoot the Wavering than anybody. Okay, he looks like he's dropping heat too. So who's up next? 15 is this guy. Yeah, he's harassing us pretty well from up there. Order. Finally, we're almost there. Yeah, we need a Clan XL and a bigger core. What we need, firing on this guy. Yes. Target's taking a critical hit. Enjoy it. They're coming for you. Okay, the thorn. What are you doing? Okay, we need to get the Cyrano out yeah, of there. Commander. Okay, I'm first aiding now because we're going to be going into Standing battle high. here in a second. So I'd rather be ready to get into the battle and stay there without having to first aid. So that's why I'm doing it now. So now we got five turns of fighting up here. Well, four turns of fighting up here. Before we got to use it again. Let's see if we can kill this guy. Target lock on enemy rear. Nope. Not gonna bail out, are you? Standing by. Let's move. Okay, get our stability back. We'll walk it up here. Get, see if we can get the finishing blow on this guy. Fire. Yes. And that's the way we do it. Thought I was switching that for an ultra, but I'm thinking we're gonna keep that Gauss rifle. Keeping my heat low. Is that what you're doing? With no weapons. You're gonna keep your heat low. Yeah, move forward, move forward. Come on. Nope. Standing by. Look at we're overheating already. Here we go. Alright, what are we gonna fire? Definitely not this. Or this. You know what? Forget it. Can you give him something to shoot for this turn? I think that locust is trying to get around to get that thorn. Yep, shoot for me, Bubba. I'm showing That's not damage. my paint scheme, by the way. Don't know why it's showing that paint scheme. Right here. That's not my paint scheme. Oof, really? Uh... Wait... Sure, why not? <laughs> sure... Why not? Affirmative. I gotta say, Truce is doing a good job of giving us, like, good, uh, initiative here. Rear armor it is. Yes! Yes, Commander. Acknowledged. Acknowledged approach time for one. I copy. Nothing. Got like five rounds left to Goss Rifle. 
receiving you. Never thought I would use them all, but apparently we did. Let's not get too close to them. Get over here. Getting too close gives them the ability to get behind us, and we don't want that, so... Doesn't matter which one I leave off. All right. Roger. All right. Structure exposed. We'll take that. Receiving you. Stay back here. Okay, we're gonna reserve again. See what this guy does. We can capitalize, hopefully, up the thorn, the locust. Is we better get some good salvage out of this. That's all I gotta say. A couple of clan XLs or something. At least I know that if we need to go to the inner sphere, we can pull off some milk runs and just get uh, charging. Is he? No. We can get some clan XLs or something, you know? Just sell them off. They're like, what, 500,000 each or something? Yes, Commander. So if I did that, we go charge, it's a 90%, oh sorry, 46% chance to hit, but for 90 damage. So that was like, what, 15 or 18% with the lasers? It's the same whether I decide to kick him or not. Right here. I don't know, it just seems weird to me. Alright, well. Not often I do this, but let's give it a shot. For some reason, sprinting up to somebody and kicking him in the leg is easier than moving up and shooting them, but whatever. Of course, I need. All right, good damage. Took down some some kind of like weapon. Okay, he's unsteady too. Uh, who's up first? Cyrano. No, they are. Oh, of course the locust goes before me. Couldn't do it before, but he can sure as hell do it now. I'm shocked that he's not using all his damage weapons either. Animal. Ready for orders. Position confirmed. All right, we're leaving the large pulse off. Um, gonna shoot this guy instead. Gonna fire those. On it. Wow. Okay. Reporting. Seems a lot less spectacular when we don't have. Uh, the large pulse laser on. Yes, Commander. That's a back kick. Let's not. <sighs> and apparently, I can't kick him there, but I can go all the way around here and kick him. Sure. Roger that. Yeah. All right. Nice kick. It's a locust. Why is he not dead yet? <laughs> Come on, guys. Sorry, it's a locust 2C. Far more deadly. Well, technically he is. Technically he is. Um, I don't want to... I, uh, I should be shooting this guy with a Gauss rifle, but I really want to get as much salvage off this thing as I can. 
Let's just get him off the field. Look at all that stuff gone. Reporting critical hit. Receiving you. He might bail out. I don't know. Okay, we're slowing ourselves Something down here a little confirmed. bit in the Cyrano. Might be able to get him to bail out with the Locust next turn. Putting one in the back. Ready to get it on. Not the best, but let's uh, threaten this guy. Man, the Sentinel's got such good speed. Compared to the uh, Wavern. The firepower, like 15 tons of like weaponry on the shoulder. Standing by. I'm there. All right, let's see if we can finish him up now. Not bad. Affirmative. Jesus Christ! Just kill him for crying out loud. He just—he won't die. Uh, of course, he's gonna charge me. That better not have been a charge. He's missing his whole side. Okay, it's, he's kicking or something then. I'm hit. Wait. Oh, I'm hit. Wait. How is he able to melee? How is he? I wasn't allowed to. Yes, Commander. How? Is it because of my um? On the move. My armor's down to internal structure in the leg. It can't be. Firing on rear arc. Oh, for crying out loud. You're scaring him, but he ain't gonna get out of there. <sighs> Ready for orders. All right. Um, so how? My question is. The only thing I can think of is maybe he. Um, I don't know. Maybe because he has armor on both legs. I I, I don't know what it is. Um, I can't think of what it would be. Engaging with target. All right, we got the leg. Look at this thing. Reporting. Yes. I mean, that's awaiting orders. All the juicy friggin' pilot salvage, but maybe it's because I'm permanently unstable. I don't know why I can't Ready shoot him. I'm baffled. If you know, please let me know because I'm just confused. Heading out. Melee has like gotten so much more confusing than it ever has in the past. Got the angle. Taking the shot. Finally, you had to wait till everyone was watching you, did you? One last target. There it is, folks. Finally. Mission successful. All right, so we know. Okay, 146,000. That's not even going to cover our repairs, I don't think. Um, we know that we have enough replacement stuff for the thorn. So we lost the large and medium laser and two double heat sinks which I think I've got from the other thorn so we should be okay there so that guy should be able to be repaired my god the sentinel got four kills with that gauss rifle talk about a hero um, that's pretty nice I gotta say alright um, it's making me like all of a sudden starting to like gauss rifles again uh, now do we have the ability to get any mech here we got a stinger the thorns, but like, do I really care? Um, all right, what do we got down here, though? Ultra two clan beagle probe. I should be looking for a double heatsink kit first before anything. Clan endo is nice. Um, oh, seven regular double heatsinks. Uh, you know what? I can take this, but the issue is, is I need three clan double heatsinks. I should probably grab that. I need three clan double heat sinks because I my my core requires three heat sinks. 
Okay, nothing amazing down here. The Ultra 2 is a possibility. Clan Endo. SLD have cockpits. Clan cockpits. Ultra 2. Medium Pulse Laser Clan. Which is better than the regular Medium Pulse. Larger range, but more heat. Medium Laser Magnas. I mean, I don't know. Um, four ER smalls, 400 meters with no heat for 20 points damage to half a. I'm going to throw that in because I think we can get some use out of that. And then if I was to choose a mech, uh, what are we going to see more, probably? I mean, it, yeah. The Locust 1C, like, there's so much stuff on this thing. And I'm pretty sure it's running at Clan XL. So if we grab these two pieces, if we can put it together, then that's probably going to be a good get. Uh, we lost everything off the Solitaire, unfortunately. That large that large heavy laser would have been nice, but he decided to suicide, and there's not much I could do about it. 200 core. Ooh... Thinking for the Wavering, because then I could put the um, the double heat sinks in. That's a complete rebuild, though. We could use Pharaoh as well. So what if I drop those two? There's no Pharaoh here, though, is there? There isn't. Oh, yes, there is. Right there. That and that. So this thing, this, these and these would all go in the Wavering. Then that takes care of our heat issue. Get a little bit more speed, but not much. Right? And and a little bit extra weight, plus we get case with this, which would be nice to have on our mech with lots of missiles. And then we can get the LRM-15 in there. So we go that route, I think. Let's see what we get. Okay, Locust, miss, two, two mislinks parts, two mongoose parts, one stinger, one thorn part. Okay, we got the ER smalls, nice. ER large, medium pulse laser, excellent. Ultra 2, active probe, another regular beagle. Oh my god, we got some. We got a good roll. Standard fire control system can go. Another double heat sink. Three jump jets, which I'll keep. Basic sensors can go. This core can go for 100,000. All right. That's actually um, a pretty good roll. Okay. Well, only 45,000. But I guess, you know, they're all light mechs too, so it's not so bad. All right. So I am going to... Like, that one went long. So I'm going to get these mechs repaired. We're probably going to jump system. Um, and then jump back, because this is really the only one and a half skull planet. Actually, we might just wait here. 16 days for the financial report. So we'll probably wait here to see if we can get a new... Um, assassinate mission for the duelist playthrough. And then if not, I'll probably take a quick mission here with this guy, with this Lance, and then we'll jump and come back. Hopefully we can get another assassinate. That's going to be the trick, is finding the assassinate missions. Um, but I think if we jump out of the system and come back, we should be fine. Actually, before we go, um, I hope I remember to cut off that last little bit, but before we go, I just went to advance the timeline to get... Uh, our mechs repaired, and looks like uh, trial is over, and you've proven yourself in the ways of the clans. Do you want to enact your rights to claim your opponent as a bondsman? We sure do. Use another mech warrior. Nice. So it looks like we got a bondsman now, which is kind of cool because I could probably use this pilot as the second. Uh, well, I better not. I was going to say I was going to use this guy as the valet for uh, our duelist, but. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. All right, now we're done the episode. <laughs> Actually, let's go look at the pilot first before we do that. Uh, let's have a quick look. I mean, it's just interested to see what he's like here. Um, uh, sorry, barracks. I think we should make sure we've got enough room for pilots like that now too, right? We're going to have to like... Or is it the pilot in here? 
Or do they show up in the, um, you know, me and my not reading, not store. Come on. You can do this. Does it show up in the hiring hall? That's the question. Is, was it Faragio? Aye, aye. I know they were, um, Yeah, they're the elemental pilot. Exoskeleton operator, bonus health, athletic, honest, brave, dependable, and disgraced. ECM shield and probe, minus one morale. Do we grab her? I'm, ex I'm thinking that that's... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, so it has to be her then. Because I don't know who else it would be. Minotaur is just a regular Standing pilot. By. Long shot, I think it's just orders. a regular pilot. Yeah. Commander. So she's the one. So we're going to hire her as the, that she's the bondsman pilot, so we'll hire her. New mech warriors available. Uh, let's go back to barracks. See really quick if she's got some skills. I know she was an elemental pilot, but... She can pilot... She's only a mech pilot, too. Okay. Awaiting orders. All right, bit of experience, so let's put, the, let's put it there and there. Training complete. All right, now we can end the episode. That's kind of nice now that we've got a, uh, a bondsman pilot, though I should probably... Maybe we just get rid of Igor now and we keep an extra space in the uh, mech bay. By. I think so. Oh, wait. Uh, Igor's not the one with uh, the tech, right? No. Okay, perfect. There we go. This guy is. What's up, boss? I should call him Tech, because if I don't, if I don't, I'm gonna forget. All right, end of the episode here, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to, feel free to subscribe and drop your comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, I'll see you later.